assalamu alaikum welcome back with a new lesson today's lesson is based on finding hcf and lcm there are various methods for finding hcf and lcm but in today's lesson we will be focusing the method of prime factorization for finding hcf and lcm so our focus will be on prime factorization so we will see how we can use prime factorization to find hcf and lcm so suppose we have to find the hcf and lcm of the numbers 30 and 45 so here we will use prime factorization so first of all we will write 30 and 45 as the product of prime factors so 30 can be decomposed into its prime factors as 2 times 15 and 15 can further be broken down into 3 times 5 so the prime factors of 30 are 2 3 and 5 so 30 so 30 can be written as 2 times 3 times 5 similarly 45 can be written as 3 times 15 which is 15 is 3 times 5 so the prime factors of 45 are 3 3 and 5 so 45 can be written as 3 times 3 times 5 so now we have to find hcf and lcm hcf is found by multiplying all the factors which appear in both of these two lists so which are the numbers which appear both as factors of 30 and factors of 45 3 so this factor is common in both 30 and 45 similarly 5 is a common factor so to find hcf we multiply these factors which appear as factors of both of these two numbers so hcf is equal to so hcf is 3 times 5 which is 15 and lcm so lcm so lcm is found by multiplying all the factors which appear in either of these two lists so lcm is so 2 times 3 times 3 times 5 so in lcm we will write all the numbers which belong to either of these two numbers so lcm is 2 times 3 times 3 times 5 is 90 so lcm is 90 so here we saw that in order to find hcf and lcm by prime factorization what we do is first of all we decompose the given numbers is products of their prime factors and to find hcf we multiply the factors which appear as factors of both of these numbers and to find lcm we multiply the factors which appear in either of these two numbers so this is the method of finding hcf and lcm by the method of prime factorization now let's take another example now we are going to find hcf and lcm of 60 and 72 so 60 and 72 so first of all 
we will write both 60 and 72 as products of their prime factors. So 60 in prime factors can be decomposed as 2 times 30 and 30 can be written as 2 times 15 and 15 is 3 times 5. So the prime factors of 60 are 2, 2, 3 and 5. 2 times 2 times 3 times 5. Similarly, the prime factors of 72 are 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 3. So now in order to find HCF, first of all we take the numbers which appear as factors of both 60 and 72. And these numbers are 2, this 2, and 3. So these are the factors which appear in both of these two numbers. So HCF, HCF is equal to 2 times 2 times 3 which is 12 and LCM is equal to, so here in LCM we will multiply all the factors which appear in either of these two numbers. So so we have 2, 2, this 2 and 3, this 3 and 5 which is equal to 360. So LCM is 360. So we learned that in order to find HCF and LCM by prime factors, we first of all decompose the given numbers as products of their prime factors and in order to find HCF we multiply all the factors which appear as factors of both of the given two numbers and to find LCM we multiply all the factors which appear everywhere as factors in both of the two numbers. And I hope that you have understood the method of finding HCF and LCM by prime factorization.